Hi, in this video, I am going to show you how to install WordPress theme by using WordPress. At first, we should go bythos.com, then sign up for free hosting, a subdomain name, it can be anything as you wish, it is not important too much, then a password. A email address to sign up by the host <coughs> then a confirmation email please check your email and it is a spam folder click the spam folder and uh, you will get a account activation folder email with this and wait a few minutes it sometimes it take one to two minutes and this is my by host control plan account all details there also a mail with details in your mail please check it again in a spam folder you can see every details of uh, of your ByteHost account, username, password, host account, link, control plan, also site link and it is very very important. Now click the control plan link and you will get a panel. Copy the username from your email, also copy the password and paste it then login <coughs> yes this is our by test panel there are three things very important online file manager PSP my admin and my SQL database now next step is WordPress go to WordPress and download the WordPress theme <coughs> already I downloaded one copy please extract it then open the extract folder You will get another folder there inside and open it. Select all the component and zip it. Remember that select all the component and zip it from the inside folder. And drag the zip folder outside in desktop. It will be WP admin or other thing. Now go to use by host control plan and click the file manager option again click the online file manager HTTP docs click the upload click the choose file from right side and WP admin which was zipped few minutes ago and click the right button and wait few minutes you will get this information <coughs> now we should go to control plan again and click the PSP admins there is no database so we should create a database account click the here option and create a database option you will get a created database option you can use anything any name here it is just name for database 
where I use food blog as a database. This is not my site name, not my user name, it is database name. The important thing is the C details database name, database, MySQL username, MySQL password, MySQL host name, etc. It is the most important thing to sign in WordPress. Then the next step is in your Gmail, go to your Gmail and click one link of, of this is two link. Yes, our data WordPress site has been installed successfully. Now click the content, new button and let's go. Database name, copy it from the Bythost control plane database option. Paste it, copy it from Bythost control plan, MySQL password in your email which was used to create Bythost account, Then submit run to the install if everything is okay this is site title it is most important for which was which will be your site title main site title so use it be carefully i want to use my site title as a food blaze so here i used food blaze option then a username then a username it should be new it should be something new because it is it is not by host information it will be wordpress information so something new then password please use the strong password it will be your password to sign in wordpress then a email to sign in wordpress it can be same or any other thing other email Now click the install WordPress, success and should login by using username and password which was created few seconds ago. Yes, this is our WordPress theme and now need to customize it to publish. To get the customization video, please subscribe. Thanks for watching.